Hey everybody, what's going on? Welcome back to another reaction. We are checking out, I believe the translation, the song is called Dangerous by Boy Next Door. This is a pre-release from what I understand. We checked out Boy Next Door's last comeback, uh, which I really, really enjoyed. And I thought, why not check them out again, since I enjoyed them so much. And the music video was pretty freaking wild too. So very, very excited about this one. And uh, without further ado, let's go. Everybody, be quiet. Mom and dad should not hear this song. Ooh. I to put on their phones. I got I'm you. Sure you're low, low, great, bro. Got you. Come on, come on, come on, come on, please, son. All the time, good guitar, I don't need one. Hi, mom, you get to the train on the upper the water, so that's how you get to the gym. Phone on being in mode, I go. Tag a chin, Netflix, and chill. Tongue on the man, four way, um. Chit that on, or you'll be dead, G. Sing it. Tag a chit, don't you? Oh, that was a cool transition. Sing a mouse, so you're my puppy. Morning, man, do, booty, get like, I go. I'm done, I'm a son, it got you, no, then I can take it. Learn a minute. <laughs> They're doing a TikTok. <laughs> nice. Sorry. <laughs> They're memeing. <laughs> nice. I love this concept. My youth is my shield. Damn. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Uh, the reflexes are not strong with this one. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> they are quite literally boy next door. Or up the other door. Uh <laughs> the dad waking up and turning into Homelander was kind of cool with the logo and everything. Uh, damn. This was such a fun music video. The song itself is like literally the most adorable, rebellious boys next door. You know, rebelling, but like... It's... In a world where nowadays kids rebel in like movies and tv shows and in real life and shit is very very chaotic and very violent and very gruesome they kind of like brought it back to like old school rebelling with just you know being with your friend and staying out late and you know uh you know just being yourself uh which i really really enjoyed and i i love the emphasis on like the keychain with uh, with them being young because they're not doing anything crazy at the end of the day so there, there's still like this purity about about them as they're literally just on a rooftop eating, having fun and n not doing anything crazy, just being friends. So I, I really, really enjoyed that. Um, the concept for this music video is really, really dope. I've ignored my mom's nagging when I was little. Uh, yeah, uh, it, it's very, very relatable. Uh, I never tried my dad's designer clothes. He didn't have any, but, uh, you know, 
or any jewelry because he didn't have any. Uh, so that never cried. I I tried to use his uh, razor once and uh, almost had my ass handed to me for that because uh, I was very little and had no beard. But, you know, it's like that home alone scene. Uh, you know, I, I really... I didn't get to the part to actually scream from the, you know, uh, aftershave uh, bomb, but, you know, I did try to shave myself, even though I didn't have any, any hair on my face uh, at the time. So that wasn't a good, uh, that wasn't a good experience. Um, I didn't get to even the part where I got to shave because my parents came home and saw it. And, you know, my, ma my mom kind of laughed, but my dad wasn't too fond of that idea. Um, but, uh, yeah, the actual, I love the memeing, like the TikTok that they did with, you know, the son expressing both the dad's POV and his own POV. I love the meme itself too. It was really, really cool. Um, I just, I love the fact that they're, they say I never crossed the line and literally the music video doesn't cross any lines at all. They're just being fucking goofing around, being fucking adorable and rebelling in, in the cutest way, really. If if that's the kind of rebellious teenagers that you have, then be fucking glad. In 2024, this is a dream rebellion uh, scenario for your child, you know. Um, let's put it that way. With some of the shit that we see uh, happening online and in the real world, like that that that's that's the cutest kind of rebellious uh cutting your hair too was uh like it, it looks so dark but at the same time i love the line with the granny told me that the dad was just like you when he was little and you know cutting the hair wanting to rebel it instantly kind of like reminds me of like metaphors of like wanting to cut out something from your past and whatnot you know uh rujin's hair cut in uh wannabe is the first thing that i always mention whenever i see somebody cutting their hair but here is just like you know your dad is a do as i say not as i do kind of individual so him telling you not to do all of those things but then your grandmother tells you that your dad was all of that you are and even worse that makes you want to be a little bit more like your dad so it's like the apple doesn't really fall too far from the tree um so so that was a cool representation um of that too um i i love the way they introduced the the song to like put on your headphones because nobody should hear this you know mom and dad are asleep so i feel like i'm very very helpful in not waking them up but i do i do wonder about the logo as the dad wakes up and turns into homelander too um is that be them being caught or is the dad like i'm 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 not sure and i'm i'm sorry that i'm not sorry that is just a super adorable song that actually has a little bit of like gravitas to it like it, it's it like the rap section is really really cool the the actual instrumental is like not as you know uh fun and poppy it's like a little bit grittier i really really like that so it's like they're, they're them being gritty in the most adorable way is really really dope in my opinion this was awesome um this definitely puts a smile on my face and i hope it did to you as well uh so if you enjoyed this reaction let me know in the comment section and uh, yeah, check out my other Boy Next Door reaction, which is there's only one, unfortunately, but uh, hopefully once the heat kind of like dies down and there's not so much crazy shit happening with all kinds of releases and putting out like five to seven videos a day and whatnot, we'll be able to kind of like dive a little bit deeper into Boy Next Door because I've enjoyed the two releases that I've checked out so far and I'm definitely uh, am going to check out their comeback at the very least so, and hopefully in the future we'll be able to focus on some of their debut stuff as well. So if you enjoyed this reaction, like this video, subscribe to the channel if you're new and I'll catch you all in the next one. Be well and safe wherever you are.